As medicine is one of the most competitive fields of study in Germany, being admitted at a university is incredibly hard. Applying right after graduation without being among the best of the year is senseless, right? Only the best of the best can study medicine in Germany, right? Wrong. Hey, I'm Felix, the happy one, and I'm a first year medical student from Germany. And in this video, I'll show you three alternative ways to get into German med school. One quick thing before we get right into it. Have you already applied to a public school in Germany to study medicine? I am happy to see your answers in the comments down below. Okay, today we'll start off with studying in Austria. And yes, I know once again, Austria is not Germany, but I mean, they are right next to each other and they both speak German, so see, practically Germany. 20% of the places available in Austria are reserved for students from abroad, but just from the European Union. If you're not from the European Union, there are 5% of all the places available just for you. But there's one problem when applying in Austria, which is the MedAT. The MedAT is the nationwide entrance examination for medicine in where applicants who've been selected in the process prior are tested in the subjects of chemistry, biology, mathematics and general cognitive function. When reaching a certain score, you will get a place to study in the university you took the test in. And this is the problem. You can apply to many universities to be selected for the test. But since all the examinations are on the same date and the same time, you need to decide for one facility where you want to take the test in. Keeping in mind that test results are not transferable, so you only get one shot per application period. But otherwise, a cool option worth checking out. Your ease of application? Quite easy because there's no grade point average required, but voluntary work and further qualifications will better your chance of being selected. And your chance of admission? If you really put in the hard work into the meta T and reach a top score, you're almost guaranteed. Just keep in mind that the test goes deep into the topics of science. Be prepared! Another way to study medicine would be studying in Hungary. And before you say no, let me tell you this. The well-known Semmelweis University in Budapest, the capital of Hungary, is the oldest German-speaking university in the world and you can still study medicine there to this day. Especially the Semmelweis University is known for its exceptional training of young doctors. The focus on the Hungarian system lays much more on practical skills and oral exams. After graduation, you'll be a doctor made age for Hungary, but no difference qualification-wise. You could also study in Budapest for one year and then transfer your studies to the Asclepius campus in Hamburg. This only de depends on the kind of cash you have to spare. But keep in mind, this only works at the Semmelweis. On the other hand, a transfer after two years of study in Hungary is possible at any university. The exams you write after two years are internationally accepted and allow for a transfer to Germany without any problems. However, the only real downside might and will be for a lot of people, the tuition fees of seven to 8,000 euros per year plus the average cost of living. Your ease of application will be much higher than in Germany because there's not that much competition and they are not that grade point average focused. And the last way of today would be studying at private German med schools. This is something people hear and they stop listening right away. But I personally think that it's an option worth looking into. Because the application process for public medical schools in Germany makes it impossible for students who are not the best performers in school to study medicine, some small private institutions open their doors for a small number of students to study medicine based off of their motivation, determination and their individual skill set. They don't take into account grade point average. These schools figured out a new learning concept from the ground up which is much different from the public version. Since there are a few of these private institutions who are training doctors with all their own curriculum and all their own philosophies, the government had to make sure that the graduates from those schools can keep up with graduates from public school. And let me tell you, they did. Private schools like Uni Wittenherdecke are nationally known for the best training in the medical field. But since these private universities 
um, oftentimes much smaller than normal universities, your knowledge and your training is much more direct. On the other hand, does this small number of students and place available makes it really hard to get into them. Nearly all of these schools, while not looking into the grade point average, are testing the applicants on a much more personal level. Extensive entrance examinations and psychological tests will determine whether an applicant will get admitted. And after admission, there's always the question of money. The tuition fees at private universities are without any doubt exceptionally high. But there are many different options available, from committing to work in a hospital in a certain area in Germany, or paying after your graduation when working as a doctor. All in all, I highly recommend every future doctor to look into this option, since there are so many different ways. However, I hope that you found something that will get you into medical school very soon. And I can highly recommend watching this video about even more ways to get into German med school or watch the entire playlist. And if you like this video, please leave a like rating and subscribe to my channel for more medical school related content. Thanks for standing me until next time.